Right, there we go. Alright, so last time we finished... Why are you talking to me? Oh, it's because I completed a bunch. Yeah, it is. Get golden all challenges. I guess we're, pu we're pushing it. This guy I haven't talked to in a while. Explore all caves. Okay. How many more people want to talk to me? Anyway, there are still the Olimar missions to do. But I might I might do those near the end. Cause I'm not really sure what those entail. Uh do, 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 do. but I believe I have some night expeditions to do since I did finish the hero's hideaway with hundred percent. I'm mostly just checking my percentage. Yeah, hundred percent. Okay. Giant's Hearth. Hmm. Uh, we'll go there once we're ready. First, we got some nighttime stuff to do. Here's Hideaway, three spots. Let's get them done. I'm really, I'm really enjoying this game. I love Pikmin. I've been having a great time with it. I'll be sad when it's over. I'm just checking to make sure my camera's still in the generally the same area. I know it's a little bit wider than it has been. I've been, I've been fussing with it a little bit. I guess it's this hand. Yeah, I've been fussing with it a little bit. The reason will become clear probably once I finish Pikmin. Okay, so the enemy shouldn't even be able to reach. But there's a flying enemy I just saw in the corner. Oh no, the luminol's here on the table, okay. Let's go activate this triknol so that they don't have to go all the way up. Oh, there's another luminol over here. You guard the orange one. I guess I gotta command him again. Can you, like, please any one of you come here so I can throw you on him? I do not think I have enough glow Pikmin. Okay, there's the enemies. Let's go intercept them. Looks like there's a whole bunch that are about to go attack the Luminol over here. I'm gonna think it's, it's easier if I have the speed that Ochi gives me. I know that it's tempting to have a, uh, a second guard.
I guess I gotta get you on the butt, not in the face. These guys off before they can wreck the day. Alright, let's go cut these guys off before they can get it up to the luminal. them all on there. I think this might be the last wave of them. Easy enough. In Yanni, I don't know why you doubt me. I've I've done every single one of them up to this point and you're still being a doubter. I don't know what I've what I've done to deserve such <sighs> Am I just gonna re reuse the word doubt? <laughs> such a lack of faith. I wonder if I'm going to come across any night defense missions with more than two luminals. Probably. And then those will be particularly harder. And I'm assuming f if one luminal gets destroyed, then they the entire night fails. You have to protect all of them. At that, at that point, trick nulls will be very important because they'll buy me the time I need to get around faster. Hey, Olimar. I'm happy to see him. The character from my childhood, man. So now that I have two cures, are we going to only cure one person? Or am I going to cure them both at the same time? I don't know if I've ever had two cures available at the same time. Well, look who's up and about. How are things going? Olimar, why are you awake at this hour? I don't know. I just woke up, I guess. I'm interested in night expeditions. Is it okay if I observe? Oh, I'm sorry. Tonight's expedition just wrapped up. Bad timing on my part, then. I'll try again next time. Yes, please. You're welcome to observe any time you like. You are the only one whose commentary I welcome, Olimar. The rest of these guys can shut up, particularly Colin. <laughs> Administer the cure at once. Oh yeah, get them both cured. Kit, an expert in minerals and social niceties. He joined the task force to study raw materials alongside former classmate Osa. Como, here to study hydrologic cycles. She hopes her research will save her home planet from industry-caused ecological destruction. No. Claro. 
Good morning, officers. I'm calling this strategy meeting to order. Let's recap our current situation. Ochi's condition, or rather his tail's condition. If we can't cure his leafy appendage, we can't leave this planet. Luckily, there is a veterinarian on this planet, Nell, who might just be able to help us and cure Ochi. And we believe she's located in the same area where the, those newly received SOS signals are originating. Okay, then for Ochi's sake, let's find Nell as quickly and efficiently as we can. Copy that. We, I feel like we were already all on the same page with that, but... You, whatever you, whatever you say, Captain, who am I to question you? What is your mission again? Oh, carrying these things, okay. Easy enough. I like your pace, keep it up. Uh, of course. All right. I don't know if any of these people I rescued want to have a chat with me. You do. I'm Como, an eco-hydrologist. The environment on my planet is well below standard. The water quality and natural purification systems are devastated. I'm here to investigate the water on this planet and use my findings to improve the state of water back home. <laughs> Getting leafified was, uh, scary. I can't thank you enough for saving me. <laughs> uh, excuse me. You've saved a lot of lives. I guess that means you're pretty skilled. Thanks. You got leafified. I guess that means that you're not that skilled. You, you kind of look like me. You have a you have the same hair as me, and the same kind of face too. We just have different eyes, mostly different hair color and eyes. Well, thank you for saving me. My name's Kit. I spend most of my time investigating minerals. In fact, that's what I came here to do. The minerals on this planet are amazing. I've got so many different kinds of minerals that. Ah, I'm sorry. I started to get carried away there. The important thing is that you know how much I appreciate you rescuing me. You're welcome. Okay. Um, I guess we're going to the next ne net expedition. Location numero dos. Feasting center. I'm just, I'm, I'm scared, even if they're not hit, hit directly by a glow mob. What is a glow mob? Ah, nice, we have the ice ball orbs. I don't know if the glow pikmin can do anything to them. Do I only have the one luminol this this time around? Kinda looks like it. I wanna go kill that ice guy because he's so close. That is a big egg. This big egg kind of scares me, I'm not going to lie. What happens if I smash it? Oh. Nice.
this guy out. Looks like that guy over there is angry. Ah, no. He's flying in. Those guys came from above. Another couple of guys coming from above. Sorry, give me a second. I gotta charge my uh, thing back up. I'm I'm screwing this up. wasn't so bad at all. I feel like that was easier than the previous night. Only get one cure, though. I wonder if Olimar will have been awake to observe this one, or if he's just going to sleep through all of them. We got one more, and then it's off to the new area. I'm excited to see where this goes. I'm, I'm simultaneously wanting the game to get a little bit harder for me, while also dreading what would happen if the game did get harder for me. <laughs> I, I want to stay in the position where I want the game to get harder. That's where I want to. That's that's a good uh a good level to be at. Hey there, Mr. Waxy. How you doing? Just finished another night expedition. I got one more to do. Thanks. I've, I've never been a particular fan of my voice, I'm going to be honest with you, but I appreciate it. Thank you. Have I been using glow seeds? Absolutely not. I already get so many glow Pikmin as I, as I go through, uh, <laughs> as I go through and just spam and collect everything I can. You're not conducting experiments on the glow Pikmin, are you? No, of course not. Glow Pikmin are fine. Yeah, you know. <laughs> yeah, how do you know that all that stuff doesn't uh, doesn't affect the Glow Pikmin at all, huh? I can't do anything unkind to them. Yeah, I'm sure. Exactly. For once, I agree with you, Colin. For once in a... In a, in a Blue Moon, Colin will say something that I agree with. Alright, so we got one more night expedition to do, and then we're off to the new area. Um, I didn't rescue anybody new, so I don't think there's anybody new to talk to, really. Heroes hideaway at the foot of the stairs. This is the first four level four difficulty night expedition I've been on, I think. So let's see how let's see where this goes. 